Okay, now we're going to demonstrate how to set up a fossil plate ready to take a bite wing exposure. The two types of uh, bite wing holders that we're going to use, um, uh, one is the uh, cardboard stick-on cardboard tab and the other one is a quick bite, which is a, both a holding and an aiming device. The first thing you do is assemble your fossil plate. You make sure that the fossil plate goes into the cardboard cover correctly and you, the end result should have the um, metal sensor um, sitting into the notch on the white cardboard side. Now when you place the fossil plate and the cardboard into your uh, plastic barrier, you open it up and then you slide it in. Now the important thing is that you slide in black to black. Okay, Slide it in and once you've got it in you then remove the adhesive strip and stick them together. That's your fossil plate. Okay. Now for your cardboard uh, tab, your stick on cardboard tab, you take off the backing paper, <coughs> you fold it at the fold as it says and then you join them together like this. Okay, this is still sticky on this end and this is what you stick to the actual phosphor plate. So you need to stick it on like so. And there is your phosphor plate with a cardboard bite wing tab uh, ready to take the exposure. And for the quick bite, okay, as you can see it's got a holder at this end. It has a, 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 a little narrow opening that allows you to, for, for placing the fossil plate. Now you need to take care when using these quick bites because the plastic is um, hard and it's also quite fragile. So you, if you're going to, you pull it away to allow you to slide the fossil plate in but then don't pull it away too um, aggressively because then you can break it. Okay, then you turn it around, make sure you place it evenly on the fossil plate. So check the back and check the front. Okay, and there you have your quick bite ready to take a bite wing radiograph.